Hello, welcome to another video by JT12's RC Video. We're out today with the Absima or Absima 81BL. Last week we took it down the beach and we ran a three cell 11.1 volt LiPo in it, ran very, very well. Today we're going to be using another three cell LiPo. Despite what the manufacturer says and advises you to only use two cell, we're actually going to be using three cell on this one today because on this ground that's unfortunately a little bit wet, I just want to see how fast it is on road down the beach. Very difficult to gauge how fast it is. So let's. Um, Cut to the chase, let's get to it. As I say, we've got a 2200mAh um, hard case LiPo installed in there. Uh, had an XT60, XT60 connected, so I'm using a XT60 to Dean's um, adapter. And let's get going, we'll give it a go. Okay, so the ground's really, really wet, so I'm gonna have to sort of build up the speed slowly because on the pre-cell LiPo, this thing's got too much power. So let's give it a go. Verdict is um, on three cell lipo on this sort of um, terrain on the wet tarmac, it's simply just 
too powerful it's sort of uncontrollable it, I mean it's fun but it's just it's just too much power the tires are the tires struggled with it with three with three cell power um, one thing I do like and somebody did actually post a comment on one of the videos and that is why are these body posts so long well actually to be honest today in this situation where it's been flipping and doing what else not these have actually really helped they've saved the body shell from getting severely scratched which is great so you can see it's quite severe damage to those there um, but overall so far so good the spur gear is still surviving even on three cell lipo battery time is probably about 12 minutes or so on the three cell on the two cell it was around um, eight or nine minutes and that was a larger capacity which is interesting um, but apart from that so far so good it's, it's a really really fun uh, car to drive um, I just think maybe with some perhaps some better quality tyres on here would be one thing and I, I, I seriously think I reckon if this was a dry um, surface today I think this thing would, would pop wheelies. Um, yeah so far so good, more videos coming soon.